Badger Bob's is very big in the community due to the fact you have three owners and you have a lot of people that work for the company. We are 115 strong, so we are big in giving back. Uh, we are big with the Peyton Wright Foundation. We are big with the Boys and Girls Club. We are big with the Cancer Society. We have all lost loved ones, so we do try to give back, you know, pay it forward. Uh, I'm a big believer in karma because if you don't give forward, it ain't gonna come back. Well, I think it's important whether the community knows it or not that we're behind the scenes uh, donating our time, our money, our efforts uh, to make things better in the community, whether it be for you know giving blood or the Peyton Wright Foundation, uh, the, the time, the money that's donated, and the networking that we do to try to tell people that if there's something we can do to help you, you know, just let us know where we're there for you. Badger Bob's is owned by three of your local boys. We are a family-owned company. Nobody else is. So right here, your money stays right here. When you own a, co uh, a local company, it's very important. To, uh, the money stays back in the community. It's not sent somewhere else. Your money gets taken in right here, and it gets spent right here, and we reinvest it in this community. It doesn't go outside of this community. So we keep it here. If we donate it to the Boys and Girls Club, it gets made here, it gets donated to the local Boys and Girls Club. It gets donated to the local Peyton Wright Foundation. It gets donated to the local uh, Cancer Society. Right now, we're donating blood to the local blood bank, not to the Tampa blood bank. We try to keep everything local, that's what we do. So with Badger Bob stepping forward, encouraging not only their staff, their employees, friends of Badger Bob's, but going out into the community and in, including all of their wonderful patrons for this business. So Badger Bob's, way to go. Awesome community sponsor. We are a large company, a middle-sized company, about 115 employees. And, and that can kind of scare some people because you're too big to give me the customer service that I deserve. And the fact of the matter is quite the contrary. Uh, this company, everybody knows here in the culture, is that we will do the right thing to make a customer happy. And if we sometimes make a mistake, which can happen from time to time, we believe and we instill on all of our employees that the correction of that mistake should far outweigh any mistake that's there so that the story that customer tells is the correction, not the mistake. I think it's mainly because of the owners being involved. I mean, you know, Keith goes out on calls, Bob goes out on calls. I go out on calls with people can't figure it out, some of our techs, and, and it just tells its own story. Um, and we're very personal, and we get there within two days of the service call, mostly the same day a lot of times. That is the difference. You will see one of us on a service call every single day.